Hello again. Uh, right, what we're going to do now is go back to GN3 page 148 and table B1 and we're going to look at uh, trying to work out the, the um, resistance of a piece of twin and earth cable. Let's say the twin and earth cable is uh, 35 meters long and what you've done is you've shorted out the link between earth and live at the distribution board for that circuit and you go to the other end of the circuit with your mega and you're measuring the resistance between what we call R1 and R2 and the result you're getting is say 0 0.5 76 of an ohm. So if we know it's 35 meters long and we know that it's 2.5 and 1.5 cable so in other words R1 is 2.5 and R2 is 1.5 and that's when and earth so we go there and we measure 0.76 what we want to do is find out if that's a correct sort of figure that we're looking for is it high or is it low what should it be okay so the way we can find that out is to look in table B1 again and look down for 2.5 and 1.5 cable is here and the figure in the book is 19.51 milliohms per meter so we know the formula is effectively for resistance that cable r1 plus r2 in other words equals B1 times the length divided by a thousand. This is our B1 figure, 19.51. We know the length. So what we should be getting is 19.51 times 35 divided by a thousand. And that should come to if you do that on your calculator, 19.51 times 35 divided by 1000 equals 0.68 of an ohm. So you can see there, this is the sort of figure you're expecting and this is the figure you're measuring so you've got to make a decision as to whether that's acceptable or not I would say it's probably a little bit suspect I would check all the connections in that line to make sure they were okay to see if you can get it down to a bit more of what you expect however don't forget that these figures in B1 are at 20 degrees centigrade so if you're measuring this on a very warm day, maybe 25, even 30 degrees in some places, you might get a higher result. So you've got to make a judgment about the two results. That's what you're measuring. That's what you should be expecting. Okay, thank you.